In this video, we're going to take a look at creating sheet formats inside of Inventor. So here we are continuing on with this custom title block and custom border we've already created. I'd like to create a set of sheet formats to readily pick different sizes and different title blocks I might want to have for different scenarios. So again, if I had, you'll know, say, three or four different title blocks, maybe I had different client title blocks, maybe I had a main size title block and a multi-size title block, which was more truncated. I might want to create a sheet format that represents when I do a multi-sheet and when I want to pick a D size versus an E size or an A0 versus an A3. What we have up here is a sheet formats node in our drawing resources. And once we have our borders and our title blocks set up the way we want, we can very easily create a sheet format just by right clicking on our active sheet and saying create sheet format. Now this here is an A size and it's a landscape. So I'm going to call this one a size landscape, and this will be the main sheet. So if I had a multi-sheet A size package, then I might have a smaller title block, which I might use for the multi-size. And now I have a sheet format called A size landscape main. Now if I right click on this sheet and modify it, let's go portrait, and I'll create a sheet format for this one. So this will be A size portrait main. And let's create another sheet here. I'm going to do a B size. And I'm going to do this one to be landscape as well. And this one, maybe I don't want any title block. So I'll go ahead and delete the title block off of that. I'll create a sheet format out of this. This will be B size reference because I don't have any information on it. Maybe I just put some views in here for reference. So I now have three sheet formats. If I would like to create a new sheet, I don't have to right click and say new sheet and then reselect everything I want in that type of sheet, like borders or title blocks or anything else. I can actually just come up here and double click on a sheet format and it creates now sheet two for me with the settings I saved as that sheet format. What I'm doing here is something that not everybody does. This is more of an optional thing you can do with your drawings if you just want to have a nice saved set of sheet formats to readily grab and to access. If you only ever use B size, if you only ever use one title block, this really isn't as big of a deal, but it gives you the ability to do some of this extra customization with the types of sheets you might be creating for mains and multis, for landscape, for portrait, for reference and non-reference, for let's say client submittals or versus a production drawing. They might look different. So this gives you the ability to create these different types of formats for your drawing sheets. 